Samana Dominican Republic was a real surprise for us because all I knew about it, the reason I wanted to go to Samana is because in brochures I have seen pictures of Bacardi Island where they have this beautiful Gran Bahia Principe Lavantado Resort. So I wanted to go. It's, I, it's uh, Lavantado Island, but it's Bacardi Island because some of the pictures look like they're right out of a Bacardi ad. So I wanted to go and see this. It was just like unbelievably beautiful. Well, it so happens that the whole peninsula is like that. But for us, what was really a unique experience while we we're in uh, Samana, and especially at the Grand Paradise Samana, is that one of our videos while we we're traveling had gone viral. And it was a video about a giant tarantula on my hand, specifically a Goliath tarantula. And now I'm wondering, like with all the palm trees you have in this area and the fact that it's so underdeveloped, tall grass, I wonder what the population of tarantulas are in this area. And because we have uh, infrared uh, lights for our cameras, we can film in virtual darkness, even up to 100 feet away, I wonder if at nighttime we would be able to see spiders or what kind of spiders, what goes, what crawls in the grass at nighttime because I can tell you it is spectacularly beautiful in the daytime but there are spiders, there are creepy crawlers, there's uh, lizards, there's all sorts of things, there's a lot of birds in this area, all things that might be food for tarantulas. Are the tarantula populations of the world endangered? Are they being killed or pesticides what what is this what is the life of a tarantula like and i am curious now so that's one of the things that i would like to explore and if you are a educator if you are curious about spiders if you have any questions whether it's to do with spiders or the reef what kind of fish are out there we're going to be doing snorkeling we're going to be filming underwater we're going to be doing more and more things but again spiders Big spiders. Whoa, baby. My spider senses tell me, be careful where you step. Walk, walk around this way. Cindy? Yes, I'm going to go. Okay. You see it? Our tarantula video is the number eight most viewed all time on YouTube Canada of all videos. And it has more than 29,000 comments. Most of them, I mean, people are freaked out by spiders. That is so amazing for me to see that in, in today's world, when there's so much information, that people are still freaked out by spiders. And that there are so many people that have phobias about them. Like they said, if, if I saw that, I wouldn't be able to sleep or all these different comments it is absolutely amazing so like I said when you look at that scenery there I wonder how many tarantulas might be in there if there are any Samana has some of the most beautiful scenery that you can find anywhere in the Dominican Republic, but not exclusively, because you can find the same thing in Punta Cana, in Bay Haib, uh, Saona Island. The, the Dominican Republic is just spectacularly beautiful wherever you go, and it depends whether you want to be alone on your beach or you want to be amongst a throng of people and uh, have the beach bar and music and all the stuff. I mean, you can have anything and everything in the Dominican Republic. So, if you have any questions about spiders or the beaches or what kind of creatures walk through there or what anything is like, please, let's make this an interactive travel. Get us some questions, something that we can start working on getting the answers for you.